Do you know what the difference is between a hostile skeptic and an honest skeptic? You can often tell by the types of questions they ask and the kind of reaction that they give you when they talk about spiritual things. So someone who is hostile to the gospel will often be combative, dismissive, resistant, respond with counter-arguments. An honest skeptic has genuine questions. They want to know. They want to understand. They're pondering. And you can often sense the hostility or honesty of a skeptic in the moment. And I remember a skeptic just like Nathaniel that I had the chance to talk with last year. There was a great uh, girl in our church who had a guy that she's a co-worker with ask her out on a date. And so she went out on the first date. They went to the second date and she asked him what he believed about spiritual things. And quickly she found out he wasn't a Christian. And you know what she told him? Well, I can't date you anymore, but I sure would love to bring you to my church sometime. <laughs> she, he had grown up in a broken home never been in church, he decided to start coming. Next thing you know, he's in our young adults small group. He's an honest skeptic. He's asking questions about the faith. He's exploring things. And I remember sending Chris down in my kitchen last year and asking him the question, what's holding you back from believing in Jesus? And in that moment, the Spirit opened his heart and he said nothing. And he prayed right there to come to faith in Christ. He moved from a skeptic to someone who embraced Jesus. That's what happened with Nathaniel. And by God's grace, that's what can happen to those that we have written names down on and are in the chicken wire out there that we have as our ones here in this congregation. 